redwood forest in San Diego. That doesn't sound like it makes much sense, but these trees in 1976 were planted here. The nation's bicentennial was celebrated with 76 trees planted here. At this point in time, about 30 years later, about 50 trees are left. Obviously, in San Diego, redwood trees do not do well. They need more moisture. They need more dew. They need a different habitat. The natural habitat of the coast redwood is barely into Oregon on the coast and south along the California coast until a little bit south of Santa Cruz. They live in the fog belt. Maybe 20, 25 miles from the coast is where they do the best. The coast redwood, Sequoia sempervirens, is a very fast grower, a very prized lumber tree. The wood is slow to rot. It uh, will deteriorate over time, but uh, a lot slower than other woods. By law, a number of years back, it had to be the only wood you could use in uh, foundations. Uh, they've backed off of that now, but that's what it used to be. These trees are without cones, but the cones are maybe an inch, no more than an inch. So for these huge trees, the tallest trees in the world, very small cones. 360 plus feet, a number of trees in the northern California coastal region. So the coast redwood is still number one in the world for its uh, height. They live over 2,000 years, which is a long time for any tree. 2,000 years old or more, some of the coast redwoods. A unique feature of the coast redwood is cloning. One, two, three, four, or more trunks from a single base. And this is a feature that's uh, helpful in the forest after fires. It will also sprout from the stumps and fallen logs. So reforestation after fires includes not only seeds, but the cloning and the regrowth from the stumps. The coast redwood is not a pine. Uh, the needles are not bundled. It's in a special family of its own, Taxodiaceae. However, uh, recent science has decided that maybe it should be lumped in with the cypresses rather than being in its own family. So is it related to the cypresses? Is it on its own? Who knows, but at least we know it's not a pine. Coast redwood, the ability to clone is helpful after fires. When these trees died, they were cut down. You can't have in a park area old trees that are going to fall. So they were felled and hauled away. You can see the tree rings here, representing an age, perhaps. The dark rings represent slow growth, and the wider, lighter rings represent uh, faster growth, like a spring and a summer, perhaps. Okay, let's count the rings. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. This tree is a little over twelve years old. So this was a very fast grower. From a single tree initially, we have a cloning situation. We have one, two, three, four, five, and a little one. We have five or six trunks from a single base. Cloning is a feature unique to the redwoods. Most other conifers don't clone.